Hey everyone, it's Victor here, and today I'm going to be redoing my Sebastian makeup tutorial. I have wanted to do this for a while, because my first Sebastian makeup tutorial was really bad, and I made it because it was a video and I could put it out, but it was really bad. And I have improved so much since then, and I can't stand getting more comments of people saying like, you've done this wrong, you've done this wrong, and I'm like, yes, I know I've done this wrong. So yes, I'm going to redo it with what I've learned since then. It was a long time ago. Was it last Halloween? Last October? I've come much further since then. So that's what today is going to be. So let's just get on with it then. Okay, so now we're done with the makeup. We're gonna get into cosplay. I really hope I don't get any makeup on this shirt, because it's meant to be very clean. Um, so let's hope I don't get any black on it. Because my hands are covered in it. These shirts are so annoying because it's very difficult to keep them in that shape. <laughs> um, every time they, I wash it, it just goes up like that. So try and keep it down. I should probably starch it or something. Like they actually, you know, how they actually keep them in position, but can't be bothered really. Right, waistcoat next, I think. Or should it be the tie next? It should probably be the tie, actually. Found it. Yeah, I think this is a much better job than my previous Sebastian makeup tutorial. Um, and I'll probably keep having to redo them until I'm happy because there's still things I'd like to be better at. 
So I'm learning, and that's the thing is I've I've been willing to put myself out on YouTube while I've been learning, which is a scary thing to do because a lot of people want to criticize you. The pink hair is hilarious. Um, you can see it glowing there. I'm just gonna have to put my cufflinks in actually because I completely forgot about those. Wouldn't it be nice if a butler had a butler? Because putting your own cufflinks in while the shirt is on you is hard. Done. Done one at least. I'll do the other one now. They're nice cufflinks actually. They're kind of um fabric ones, black ones. Oh. It goes through the hole, that would be really great. But apparently not today. Oh, I can't wait to get the wig on. I've completely forgotten about styling that wig. Oh, great. <laughs> yeah, that'll be fun. Woohoo! Time to style my Sebastian wig while it's on my head. Ooh, exciting. You're allowed to laugh at me, by the way. Because I'm laughing with you. Right. So what even, all right, that looks like it should be in the middle. Maybe that one? I think I have two bits that I put in the middle. Pretty sure from what I remember. Oh dear. Oh dear. Right, and then I have to tuck that bit under. I'm gonna sit down. Okay, you guys have to help me out here. So I think it's those two bits. These bits go underneath, and I'll need... I will need... something. A clip. That's what I need. And I have many clips. Many, many, many. My 500 Kirby grips. I will never run out, as you guys know. Right, okay, so that's a sort of nice long bit of hair there. That probably could go. I basically choose which bits of hair I want to keep on for for the side bits and then the other bits I just clip to my face. That's how you style a Sebastian wig. That is the logic. Right. So that hair goes Where did that come from? I don't know where that goes. That bit needs to be trimmed better. Have I got some scissors? Oh dear, that looks like it's very far gone, actually. Hmm. It's been cut too straight. I'm not helping. If you cut the scissors up the way, it usually gives a nicer, more natural cut. Now I've got bits of hair all over my face. That's just what I needed. I should really fast forwarded through this, but probably more entertaining for you guys to watch me suffer. I will stick those two bits together so no one notices there's a problem. That is how we deal with things. Okay, that was actually mildly hilarious, mildly terrifying. I had to get up just then, where I made that cut. Because our cat, Loki, was fighting with the neighbor's cat. A lovely black and white cat. Very pretty. And I heard wailing. I don't know if it was on camera. You may have heard it on camera. I could probably like put the noise up so you could actually hear it. Things. But basically, they were fighting. And it was the most horrible noise. And I stormed out there <laughs> in Sebastian cosplay and broke up a cat fight. And part of me wishes that was on camera, but at least you know it happened. And it was an <laughs> in an incompletely styled wig. So it was almost like Sebastian just got out of bed. It was like, oh no. So that was more Grell than Sebastian, <laughs> um, to work on my Sebastian voice. So yeah, this is looking mildly okay. Mildly okay-ish. And now we have to do this side. To choose our favorite piece of hair. Is there a piece of hair that's short enough to use? Um, well all that can't be you. Where is it? Aha, uh -huh, I think that's it. 
because one side is much, much shorter. I think that's it. Yeah, okay, I think I found it. It's always a mystery, styling this wig. It really is, absolute mystery to me. This could go badly wrong, as it always does. But I managed to cover it up. You think this goes smoothly? You're wrong. It's just camera tricks. This wig is mostly pins. Mostly pins and hope. Okay, that's just a random long bit. I didn't want you here, long bit. You should be behind my ear. This would be very problematic if I didn't have ears. Ears are a blessing. I can hide everything behind them. All my mistakes. Okay, that, that's all right. That's okay-ish. I'll turn up the brightness so you can really see them. Sticky up bits. Like Sebastian's drawn with the floop floop floop. <laughs> I quite like it. Oh, my eyes actually look red. Kind of. If I turn it up even more, I can't. That's it. I like the blueness actually of the hair. It's all bright. Okay. Actually, that's much better. I'm probably going to keep it at this level of uh, brightness because it was too dark before. So, that's kind of it, really. Uh, obviously, there's the tail coat and stuff, but as soon as I put the tail coat on, I can't move my arms properly because it's very, very, very tight. It, it's quite restrictive because it's very thick cotton. Um, but it's lovely, because it's actually an accurate tailcoat. Because I would never be able to buy myself those cheap ones. I had to find... I mean, I found it in a vintage shop for not very much money. You know, you should look around. You should look around for actual tailcoats if you're one to by Sebastian, because you'd be surprised. But yes, there you have it, my Sebastian Kalis makeup. Improved. Somewhat. Maybe not entirely. Um, I can... I can... I can hope. But anyway... Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you very soon. As is tradition, here's the bit of the video where I show you my hair after I've put the makeup on. It's pretty good, right? I mean, that's a pretty good look. <laughs>